So I just wanted to say that the homeless situation around here, it's like getting off the charts bad. I mean, it's getting really bad. I have lived here in this neighborhood for about five years now, and I have never seen it this bad. Uh, I went to take the trash out to the alleyway. I opened the gate and there were some homeless people camping like along the side of my fence near my backyard. So I sh immediately shut the gate. I couldn't take the trash out. I got scared. And now I know why a bunch of cans and bottles are starting to accumulate in back behind the alley where my backyard gate is. They, what they do is they'll leave their trash when they're done camping. And then you have a bunch of mess to clean up. I had to go up out there today with gloves on and pick up all the bottles they left behind. And not only that, they will steal anything they can. Any, and I mean anything. I had some nice solar lights. They stole those. I had some potted plants. They stole those. So it's like, I can't have anything looking nice. It, it's all going to shit, okay? My house is going to shit. What's next? What? They're going to start camping in my front yard next with camp with uh, tents? And then what? Uh, and then the city, what, gives me a fine maybe? Because I allow homeless people when I have no idea because they come late at night. I mean, I actually saw a video like that where a person who wasn't at their house all the time they weren't there to watch things and some homeless people moved in with tents in their backyard. And now the city's talking about giving the homeowner the ticket because they can no longer, um, the city can no longer ticket homeless people in many places. Like all they can do is tell them to leave and they hope that they leave or they can't tell them anything. They can just stay there. I mean, is this getting what off the charts retarded or what? What's next? What they're gonna just make all of us homeless because pretty soon they'll they'll what uh, fine you and because homeless people move onto your property when you don't know it and what you can't pay your fine then what the city takes your home then what then pretty soon everyone's being made homeless I mean is this the plan or what now if cities were smart and if people were smart they would demand that we have designated parking lots with tents for homeless like they do in san diego in san diego they have whole big parking lots fenced in with people working there and every homeless person gets a designated tent in the parking lot with a shower porta potties and an address because every tent has a number which is actually an address so this way they can possibly get some kind of work as long as they have an address, I'm thinking. So everywhere should be like San Diego, not like this crazy, this city's getting really, really bad. Actually, not just behind my house, everywhere I go now. If I walk towards the store, there's an alleyway and there's always homeless people camp there. If I walk over here, there's another alleyway with some more stores because I live near downtown. And there's always homeless people camped over there. Last week, they were camped over down the my, end of my alleyway with an old mattress that somebody threw out. And it's just like they're everywhere. You can't go anywhere without seeing homeless people camped out. And again, because they changed the, the rules, the laws now, they have like a week to vacate. Like they can't just say move or we're going to give you a ticket. They're more like, Oh, will you please move in about a week or two? Like they give them like a week or two. And then where do they move? One block over. That's it. Just one block over. So they're forever going to be camping out in this area. I'm th seriously thinking about selling this house. I didn't want to. I never dreamed I would want to do that. But if they're, the city's not going to take care of this problem the way San Diego takes care of their problem with the homeless, for example, they, again, they give them a designated parking lot, fenced in, security working there. Every homeless person gets their own designated tent. They have porta potties and showers. So that's the way you do it. You don't just let homeless move into neighborhoods where they can create 
a um, ordinance or problem, you know, um, with the city, okay? So then the city can there turn around and then fine, give fines to the homeowner when the homeowner wasn't even home to know that the fucking homeless person was camping in their fucking yard. Get real.